And look at here, I have a little friend with me this morning. This is Porky. Of course, it is Tuesday, time for our Adopt a Pet segment. And every week we try to help pets like Porky here find good homes here in the Coachella Valley. So right now we are joined with Rick Miller of Save a Pet. Rick, thank you so much for joining us this morning. Thank you for having us. I love these little doggies. And so, you know, we have uh, Porky, who I'm holding, and then Tootsie, who is Porky's mom. Yeah. And they have a really amazing story. Tell us about how you got them. Them. Well, uh, Tootsie's owners uh, let her get pregnant, and she's too small. Mm. And she was trying to give birth. The animal was stuck, and they called our clinic. Our clinic said, "Bring, bring her in right away." And they waited several hours to bring her in. Wow! By that time, uh, the one puppy had passed. She was crashing. Uh, the people couldn't afford what was going to cost to save her, and we have an excellent vet at our shelter, Dr. Michael Bone. I've seen him do amazing things. She was crashing. Uh, they stabilized her. They did a C-section and had little Porky and a white little girl named Petunia. Aww. Petunia's been adopted. Uh, they're both healthy. They're both very, very sweet. They're toy chihuahuas, so uh. They're, uh, she's not going to get any bigger, and uh. Porky's probably not going to get any bigger than her. Wow, that is an amazing story, and good thing that they did uh, survive, at least Porky and Petunia did, and you're hoping to find them a nice home. Now, since this is mother and son, would you recommend that they stay together? Uh, you know, we'd actually like for them to go together, and we're willing to do a, a price break on the adoption fee for both of them. Aww. They're very, very sweet, uh, very playful, and just, they wouldn't be good for a home with small children. They would or wouldn't? They wouldn't because oh. they're a little too small. Oh. Uh, but older people, uh, some older children, or maybe even an elderly couple, uh, they'd be great. Yeah, I, I've been hanging out with Porky, and he's just so calm and just loves to be pet. And I mean, he, he would be a great little pet. And, and it would be nice to keep him together, uh, as you were mentioning. Now, I do want to ask if, if people out there have chihuahuas, and uh, especially these uh, full breed chihuahuas, mm -hmm. um, should they not uh, breed them? Or, or, what, or should they take special precautions? You know, on that, uh, I would check, have them check with their vet to see the size. Uh, some dogs are just a little bit too small and may have to have cesarean births as opposed to being able to give a natural birth. Mm -hmm. But she's pretty small, but she's sweet and adorable, and we all at Save a Pet love her a lot. Oh, and how old is little Porky here? How old He's is he? about nine weeks old, and we think that uh, Tootsie is about a year to a year and a half. Oh, okay. So they're both very young, actually. Yes. Okay, and do they need any special uh, care since uh, because Tootsie went through that ordeal? Does she need any special care? Nope, she's doing just fine. She's as healthy as a horse, as we like to say. They just need lots of love and attention for the rest of their lives. That's right. More than anything, they need a good home. And again, look at this adorable little face. You should really think about adopting Porky. He's such a good little dog. So definitely, if you're interested in adopting Porky, and hopefully you'll take Tootsie too, the mom, at the same time, because they are very cute. They love being together. Just go to Save a Pet. You can see the information right there on your screen and get a hold of Rick or anybody there, and they will give you more information about this dog.